Well, it has officially happened. Marvel TV, Marvel Entertainment is officially dead. And from the ashes of Marvel TV rises Marvel TV Studios. Yeah, they weren't really creative with that one. Okay, so most of you know the story by now. Marvel Studios and Marvel TV, the Marvel Entertainment Division, were two separate things run by different people owned by Marvel Disney. Now, there was some disconnect years ago, and now everything is under one roof with Kevin Feige. Thus, the closing of Marvel TV. So the shows that were previously under that banner that used the old Marvel entrance logo are officially all more or less done. The new wave, will be handled and have a brand new banner that is Marvel TV Studios. Now, of course, this is a take on Marvel Studios, but Marvel Studios is still gonna be synonymous with the films, while Marvel TV Studios is the TV side of things, handling the upcoming Disney Plus shows and other shows that are gonna be overseen by Kevin Feige, which is all of them. So the difference really here is that Kevin Feige now has control of everything, and we can more or less suspect that there's gonna to be a brand new intro when we get the first wave of Marvel TV studio shows. Now, if the logo is going to be, you know, the Marvel Studios logo and then they add TV in there or something, it'll probably be something close. And it really wouldn't surprise me if they add their own little layer into it, kind of like how The Mandalorian has that unique intro with the different faces and lights and everything. And then it says Star Wars. I'm expecting something like that'll happen, you know, for Marvel TV side of things to kind of just let you know, hey, this is the same yet it's slightly different it's a different outlet so that kind of makes a lot of sense and obviously for brand recognition when you search up marvel studios they're going to want the list of movies in one and then when you look up marvel studios or marvel tv studios it's another lift it's another list of separate entries so it just makes it easier for the sake of hey which one of these is a tv show which one of these is a movie well they're separate under two different companies technically